What's up guy, Charles here. The Strix Halo is no longer a rumor. According to Patches for Rockham, AMD's open source platform for GPU computation, the GFX 1150 and GFX 1151 codes, which were mentioned before are now undoubtedly referring to the Strix series. What's more, AMD is confirming that there is indeed a Strix Halo coming. Although the patches do not provide detailed information, they do reveal that the initial Strix Point Silicon is labeled as Strixone, following the naming convention of Phoenixone. The Strix Point of P you design for next-gen laptops is a mainstream silicon, while the Strix Halo aims to be AMD's competitor to the Apple M series. Both products are set to feature the Zen 5 microarchitecture with an updated RDNA 3.5 graphics architecture. Additionally, the Strix series is expected to incorporate the new XDNA2L accelerator, enhancing compute performance to a 4550 tops. This is a significant improvement over Hawk Point, which is projected to offer 16 tops and at least four times the capability of Phoenix 10 tops. The Strix Halo, categorized as an elite experience, a PU is believed to feature up to 16 Zen 5 cores and up to 40 compute units. This is not a low-power PU, but rather a powerful CPU and GPU replacement packaged into one unit. While details about Erdene 3.5 enhancements are yet to be confirmed by AMD, it's expected that such a silicon would feature more RDNA cores than the upcoming Radon RX 7600 XT reportedly reaching up to 40 compute units. However, the APU will have limits on how much power it can use. It is thought that it can use between 55 and 120 watts, which will no doubt affect its performance. AMD officially announced that Zen 5 architecture is launching this year, but the company is yet to confirm which product specifically. Recent speculation suggests that the Strix series might make its debut this year, albeit likely after the desktop series. AMD has only just announced its Ryzen 8040 Hawkpoint series, a minor update to Phoenix mobile chips. Those chips, possibly acting as a stopgap between Phoenix and Strix Point, are to be launched this quarter. The Strix Halo was first mentioned by Moore's Law is Dead, who has also revealed that the series may be slipping to 2025 launch. As a result, the Strix Halo could launch under Ryzen 9000 series, or a new class of chips altogether. The Halo series will enable AMDs to compete with Apple M series and establish a new product category for high-end small form factor systems, including gaming mini PCs without discrete graphics. Your likes, comments, and subscriptions fuel this tech journey, and I appreciate each and every one of you for being a part of it. Stay curious, stay tech-savvy, and I look forward to catching you in the next video. Until then, tech on!